let's continue to the second part of configuring the I would say the fast API open telemetry and Yaka which I've already configured in the previous video and showed you a simplest demo uh, if you haven't watched that video please do watch that video that is a very short video so let's start with it now in the same folder what we have to do is like create some docker file and inside this docker file I have already a docker file created like this so definitely I'm using the same version of the Python blah 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 and yeah no, that's how we are running it now in the same folder we have to have a docker compose dot yaml file now inside the docker compose dot yaml file we'll be having fast api service which will be running like this one thing and the second thing will be a uh, yager so uh, just put a yager so image is Yager tracing all in one latest and that's all but I'm gonna tell fast API hey fast API I'm dependent on okay which tells that hey I'm this fast API is dependent on Yager first this one will be installed and then we are setting one is the host name remember I'm setting the host name with the Yager and the uh, agent port is 6831 which is this one okay so that's pretty much it so now if I go back over here and just close I'll just show you that nothing is running I think so yeah nothing is running uh, yeah still that is running because that is in docker so I'll just go, go and stop the previous one which is stopped okay so I'll just quickly remove that one cool so docker compose up hyphen hyphen build no it's not being found so what's going on uh, okay so the thing is that over here it is that app is inside the app folder so I'll just quickly grab app folder create init UI inside that and move that one here so it should be fine I think so all right let's check it quickly and then the lit boom okay so Yager was launched plus fast API as well now if I go back over here and show you that local host that is up and running one local host one six six eight six like this and search it yes I don't have as of now that's fine that's fine so still I cannot uh, see that one even though I hit many multiple times over here so if I hit it like this 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 still I cannot see that one guess what why so the thing is that you should tell this particular docker fast API hey communicate with this one we using this Yager so go to fast API instead of localhost tell this one should be something else so just stop it and here just down it clean and now this one should be Yager now if you go back and just build it should be fine now you just refresh it I don't have anything here but if I hit it now and just hit it, hit it, save, 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 and hit it. Boom, I got the fast API user, the one I was talking about. And that's how you can see all the traces over here who called when it was called, and blah blah blah, something like that. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Don't worry, I'm gonna provide uh, the GitHub link <laughs> so that you can uh, access via the GitHub link. Please, please, please do subscribe to my channel. All right, thanks for watching, and that's pretty much it. Do let me know if you have any question before you leave. Just I'm requesting you guys, please go and subscribe. Just hit one button. That makes a lot of difference for me. If you could help me out, definitely I have a lot of options over here that I'm trying to create. So keep me motivated. I'll just keep you posted that uh, good stuff. Thanks for watching again. Bye for now.